Welcome back to the Mind is the Outer. I hope you guys are having a great day wherever you are. I hope your Sunday is going smooth. And if today someone told you that you're too sensitive, this might not be a bad thing at all. Because let's talk about empath psychic. Empath psychic, they deal more with emotion and intuition. Empath psychics, their intuition are very strong. There's a, there's a lot of psychics, but empath psychic, their intuition are very strong. So when someone calls you sensitive, sensitive is your superpowers. The other thing is, empath psychic, they can't handle crowds. It's overwhelming because of the energy that everybody is giving out in the crowds. You can be happy, you go to, let's say, Walmart at the mall, you come out, you are all, your whole mood is changed. And nothing happened, nobody cussed you out, nobody, nothing happened. You just feel, you know, your mood is changed. It's because all these people you passed by, all these people that you've been around, you are picking up their energy. And sometimes we can blindly mistaken this energy as is yours. Like empath psychic, they can blindly think, they can take somebody else's energy and they can think that's their energy. They will think that's their energy because they don't know that they have this uh, uh, psychic abilities that they can pick up other people's energy. So therefore, sometimes you don't know what's wrong with you. You just, you're like, okay, I'm, I'm feeling this way, but I don't know what's wrong with me. You don't know where you got it from. Well, sometimes it's not your energy feeling, right? The other thing is, empath psychics, once they meet someone, someone that knew, they will immediately feel their energy if this person is good or if it's bad. Right? They can sense their, uh, their energy. They can feel it deep down. They don't know how, but they can just feel it. The moment you meet someone, you immediately pick up on their energy. And you may feel like you've known them years and years ago. You've known them for like actually like a long time. But you just met them. It depends what kind of energy they give you. And this is your uh, psychic ability when it, come to, uh, when it comes to empath psychics. They're very good at... Uh, they have a high intuition. They're very good at picking up energy, right? And the other thing about empath psychic is, uh, this is very, very uh, interesting, is you can never lie to them, right? You can go ahead and say all your lies. Remember, I spoke about their intuition. In their head, there will be a tiny voice that's telling them, hey, I think this person is lying. Or they will sense some kind of energy within you that... Maybe this person is not telling the truth and they stick with that. And that's just their superpower, their psychic abilities. It's just, they're, since they're good at reading energies, you can never get away from that. You Because us, we always giving up energy. Whether it's good energy, whether it's bad energy, whether we're vibing, happiness, we always giving up energy. And empath psychic, they're very good at reading this energy from the start. The minute that you set <laughs> the minute that they set your eyes on you they can read your energy the other interesting thing about empath psychic is if they have a close friend they can just feel it if they are experiencing bad or good situation in their life sometimes it is so intense to where they can they will just pick up the phone and be like hey i just thought i should check up on you you know is everything okay right and they, they turn out to be right. You know, they turn out their friends is going through some, you know, stuff that they don't want to deal with. Their friend, they, they're having a bad day. If you have an empath friend, empath psychic friend, they can pick this energy. So when they ask you what's wrong, politely just, you know, answer them, tell them what's wrong. Don't be annoyed. It's not because they want to be in your business. It's just sometimes they pick this energy. Therefore, they will, since, you know, they're your friend, they will ask you what's wrong. I felt like something's not right. They're good at very picking up uh, their friend's energy. The reason why they're very good at this is because they've been hanging around with this friend like almost every day, let's say. So therefore, their energy already exchanging. They can send, you know, they know their friend's energy. And therefore, even if they're not around you, they still have your energy with you. They might not know this, but they do. So therefore, when you're feeling bad, when you're feeling, you know, when you're in a bad situation, the energy you give up, you know, the energy that you feel, they will also feel. It's almost like a twin energy thing. I don't know what that is, but I made it up. So, therefore, 
it's really good to have an empath, uh, <laughs> a psychic empath friends. One last thing about empath psychic also is that they attract energy vampires because because they are understanding and they are very appreciative to others. They attract energy vampires and this can be very draining. Why? Because when someone, let's say someone comes to you with their problems, they talk for, and they're very empath psychic are very good listeners. So they talk for minutes, 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 let's say 30 minutes. All this, all this, you know, negative energy that this person is feeling, even though empath psychic can give good advice, sometimes they take this person uh, pain and, and, and their bad energy and their feelings as is theirs. Therefore, after they walk away, they're feeling what, uh, what the other person was telling them. They're feeling every single pain, every single uh, bad energy like it was theirs. So this can be very draining. And the reason why it's called energy, uh, the reason why empath, uh, uh, they attract energy vampires is because it's just that's just in their DNA. People, they just sense that, hey, I think I can talk to this you know, person. I think I can tell them all my problems. But they, they don't know they're exchanging this energy since this person is an empath psychic. They really take that. They take the energy from you and they carry it as it's theirs. After they give you good advice, you might feel good. But then later on, they'll feel like, you know, they were going through this thing that you just told them. So that's uh, exchanging energy. And they can't help it because this is their gift. Okay. It's just the empath psychic. You know, that's that's their thing. So don't feel bad if somebody <laughs> says that you're so sensitive. You might want to look into that sometimes. It's just like, especially if you like you mood swings in and out or every day, you don't know why. You might also look into that because sometimes these things they're hidden and we don't even know.